All right, we're here at Furnace Creek in Death Valley. This is the slowest golf course in the whole world. So we're gonna shoot a little 18 hole and see where, see where life takes us. Okay, it's pretty good. We went a little left, but early in the morning. Okay, we got 145, but the guy said that whatever club I use for the 145 club up, since we're below sea level, the ball's not gonna travel as far. So I'm gonna do smooth nine. And I'm just gonna, I'm gonna see right now, because I don't know the yardage is here. So I'm just gonna see where things go from here and see how it plays. This is kind of crazy though, below sea level. I'm a little excited to see where life takes us today. Okay, yeah, 145. I hit a little flyer with a nine iron and I'm short of the green. That's crazy, but I'm excited for this. Pretty good, good start. All right, let's get it going. Well, not too bad, not a bad start. This is a par four from the tips. It's about 410. Just gonna try to get some nice and easy. We're gonna have a good, try to have a good round. We're not gonna get upset today. We're just having fun. Oh my God, that almost went in. I almost dunked that. That was crazy. Okay, well now we got a tester for par. I don't know how these greens roll here. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna play it dead straight and then see where it goes. Not bad. I don't mind it. We're going to want a little left on the first, then a good chip. So we'll take the bogey. That's not bad. I really don't mind that. Let's get it going. Let's have a good round. All right, we got 178 here. I'm going to club up like the, um, like the pro shop guy told me to. And actually, really nice dude, by the way. Overall, like everything here has been super nice because... One, it's like half the price that I usually pay. The average like rate that I pay is about a hundred bucks around. Okay. I see it. Went right. Okay, we have landed a little right of the car path right here. Ooh. Okay, I have to get it up there. Stuff is thick, it's wet. Let's just try to get a good, decent chip. Hmm. I don't know, that was weird. It's been happening to me a lot lately. So if you guys know how to fix it, go ahead and just shoot a little comment down there. Okay, here we go. For a bogey. Oh man, they die out. One, two, three, four. Oh man, are we about the triple bogey? This is for my double bogey. Break in there. Okay, listen, we drove. This is gonna be my excuse, and this is gonna be the only excuse today. It's triple bogey. Drove here, no warm up because they don't have a driving range. So we just raw dogged it after driving. But anyways, let's get it back. So now I am, that was a triple. It's rough. Okay, that part three kind of took our life, but it's okay. Listen, we're playing golf. And that is a beautiful thing. That's all you can ask for. Hole three, we have another part four. Let's just try to get a good drive down the, down the pipeline. Okay, we are a little right there. Okay, we have 181. We actually made it a little right of the fairway, which is good. So now we have a six iron. Always club up, remember. Remember. Let's get some, come on, baby.
That looks so good. Yeah. Okay, we're on the green. Let's get it back. Let's get it back. Remember, take care of the golf course. Always, always, anywhere you go, take care of it and it will take care of you. See it, believe it, make it. Break. Okay, I put. <laughs> I didn't leave it short. They're just not breaking. So, so they're not breaking as I thought they would. Okay. There we go. Holy crap. Here we go. Hole four. We have 152 from the blues, which is the tips. Smooth swing. Just have to keep smooth swinging, and we're gonna get the golf back. Looks good. Well, that one was a little long. We're back at the green. Not bad. Good, good swing though. We got a long putt for birdie. Now go right. Now keep going. You know what? That's crazy because I thought I killed it. Like I thought, I thought I went super hard. I'm not mad about it, honestly. I'm really not mad about it. We'll take the bogey. We will take the bogey. Okay, let's move on. It's not bad. Listen, I'm not a great golfer, but if we can just keep the scores down and have fun. That's all I care about because it's all this channel is about. Having fun, enjoying new golf courses. And that's that, baby. We have our first par five of this course. It is 573 yards. I think it's a dog leg right. I'm not sure, but it goes straight and it looks like it goes right. So I'm going to try to just go straight for now. Oh, stay in. We're going to go find it and see where that went. <laughs> okay, we have... It's still far out there. I'm just going to try to cut these trees right here and get it back in play. This is like clay. Look at this thing. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> well, we're playing the wrong hole right now. We are a little right. We're on the other tee box and we'll have a good look at it. So that's fine. I, I, I kind of lost my balance there. Okay, this is my third shot. It's not bad. The, the green is right past this tree right here. So I'm just going to go high. I have a 60. Just go high ball. See where it lands. It's a par 5. Nothing to worry about. Try to go high. There we go. Now work out for me. Get over. Hey, I'll take that. I will gladly take that right there. i tell you what, from, from where we started, this is actually not bad. I will take it. Now let's just try to get close and try to par. Up and down for par. Now run. Okay, didn't want to run. Also, that, I mean, it wasn't a great chip either, to say the least. That's not bad. Okay, that was a struggle of a hole, but we will take it. So now we are on to hole number six. We have a hole four, hole four. <laughs> Par four, hole six. Uh, I had to pull up the 18 birdies app. It doesn't work that well here because service is, we're in the middle of nowhere. Um, it's saying 440. I have to try to clear this. It's about, I don't know, two something over there. I'm just gonna try to get a decent shot and hopefully land somewhere in the fairway or some sort of grass. Oh yeah, baby. That feels so good and that looks so good. 
Straight ahead. Straight ahead. Not a bad shot. We just missed the fairway a little bit. So, but it's not bad. It felt good. Driver felt good. So now we have 188 to the flag. And I'm going to use a six again because same thing as earlier. Ball is not flying as far. That drive, like I smoked that drive. It felt really good. And it only went like 249, 250. Oh, cut that a little chunky. A lot chunky. It's okay. Okay, here we go. We landed short because we chunked it. We were just a little chunky this summer. It's okay. Now we have about 77 yards. We're going to go 60. And just a nice, nice controlled 60. Okay, well, we got the chunks. Oh, boy. We are just making this round really hard on ourselves. Okay, let's put four bogey. No break in there. Oh my God, you gotta be kidding me. They just don't wanna give it to me. Nah, it's okay. All right, we'll take the double bogey. That was on me, I shouldn't have chunked those shots. I should have just played normal golf, put it on the green on two, but that's on me. Hole seven, part four. And what I have noticed is that the Greens are a little, I mean, the fairways are a little tight here. Body yada yada. Ah, 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 ah. I just want to run. Oh, that looks so good. Please stay in. Okay, I see. Yeah, that's actually a good shot right there. Let's go. All right, so second shot, pretty good drive. We're a little bit on the right, right rough. Um, we got like 61 yards. Let's just try to put a smooth little swing, get it there. Oh, like I'm, I like this shit is, dude, boy. Okay. That's actually not bad. I like that shot right there. Let's go. We have a look at Paul. Look at this. I just went down to look at my, my putt to read my line. Pants just ripped right there. Hey, we still got that Lelo Nueve, though. Nueve Golf. Nice little belt. Make sure to cop yours. But anyway, <laughs> okay, these backstory on these pants, I've had them for like over 10 years. So they were bound to kind of go someday, and I'm glad... They lasted this long. These are actually some of my favorite pants. I probably wear them to golf like every time I golf. Let's put for par for this for these pants. A little par, baby. R.I.P. the pants. <laughs> Can't believe it. Did I hurt him? I hurt him. As soon as I went down, I just went. Quack. Damn. We're gonna have a funeral for him. I've had them for so long. <laughs> I cannot believe I ripped my pants. That's hilarious. Okay. We are on hole number eight. We are, we have 153. I'm just going to go with the nine. Luckily, the rough is so thick here. It caught the ball. So let's just try to get it up there. Now sit. Okay, that's actually not a bad shot. Now we have that putt for par. Oh my God, these pants just keep ripping even more. Oh, that was such a good putt too. Okay, we'll take a bogey. bogey go oh my God, bogey golf is okay golf. Okay, hole nine. We're Playing pretty much bogey golf right now the score is kind of like eight over i think or something like that i'm not mad actually about the score because i feel like my game isn't crazy bad but it's also like not great but it's it's good enough to like enjoy around you know what i mean 
Like when you go out there and shank every shot, then it makes it kind of hard to enjoy your round. But if I hit a couple good shots, you know, get close here and there, and then I'm happy with it. I mean, I put a good drive on it. It went straight, but straight the wrong way that I wanted it to. It was a great, it was a great shot. Straight down the wrong side that I wanted to. The fairway's on that side. Now we got 80 yards over these trees again. We're just gonna do the same thing as earlier. Go with the 60, really hard. Just try to get it close. Get over. Oh my God, that might be good. I heard it land and it sounded like a green. Okay, these greens are so hard. I shot that thing way over these trees, landed on the green, which is sick, but shot it way over and there's no divot. That's how hard these things are. I'm not mad about it. I'm certainly not mad about that one. That's gonna be my new saying. I'm not mad about it. Okay. Ding, 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 ding. Put it in the hole. I'm just kidding. All right, let's go. We have finished. We have finished the front nine. Let me count on my score. I think I'm like eight over or something. Like I said, it's not bad. It's not horrible. It's not great, but it's not bad. Okay, here we go. Hole number 10. Finish the front nine. Let's see if we can get a little here on the back nine and get some back. We're not gonna stop because since I'm already warmed up, we might as well keep it going. So hole 10, part five. It seems straight away, but a little dog leg. We'll have these trees on the right side. I'm just gonna go straight and hit a good, nice drive. Oh yeah, that's gonna work out perfect. God, that's perfect. Yeah, baby. Hug the trees right down the right down the middle. A little fairway shot. Let's get let's get hot. Okay, right down the middle. Very great drive. Now we have 257. I'm gonna go hybrid. Now, I'm not the greatest at these, but in my head, I have to start telling myself that I can hit these really good. Mind over. Mind over body? Yeah. Mind over whatever. You know what I mean. It's, it's mind over body. It is what it is. If it's not. Mind over matter and mind, mind over body. matter. What is it? It's both. Mind over matter and mind over body. Okay. Well. I used to say mind over body when I was running. Okay. Well, anyways, I just have to start getting a good. I have to start telling myself that I am the best golfer to have ever lived. And let's start hitting some good shots. Oh baby, just like that. Nice. <laughs> Look at that. You just have to tell yourself, get confidence. That's what I need. That's what I'm lacking. Confidence in my goal game. So now we're gonna go confidence. Confidence is key. Second shot, third shot right here. We are gonna get it close and tap in birdie. What do we think? What do we think, chat? Nip? No nip. Okay, cut it a little thin. We're gonna go and make a putt now. We have a birdie look. Get it close. Nah, we're sinking this. We are sinking it. Oh my God. That was so close. Okay. We, hey, par to start off the back nine. Let's try to try to keep it close in this back nine. And, okay, hole 11, 424. Come on, baby. Let's get hot. Let's get hot. Back nine, bully engage. We have woken up. It's approximately 10 o'clock. And let's do this. It's 
going to be okay. Um, I split these two trees right here. With, it, it, like the drive was nice. It was coming in. We're still in a fairway. This is still called, this is still in the middle of the fairway. We just got some trees. I got one, I shot 177. I'm going to use a six iron. Oh. Damn, I topped that. It was it was like in a weird lie anyways. Hey, it, it ran. Let's do this. Okay, we are on the green, baby. This is the par look right here. Let's put that bad boy in the cup. <laughs> I'm like, I'm reading them. And they're good putts. They're just not going in, and I should be on in two and not have to worry about stressing. But anyways, one bogeyed. Hole 12, another part four. This one saying 329. We got some wind against us. Um, hey, I'm not, like I said, bogey golf is just one mistake away from being a scratch golfer. Well, all right, we found the ball. It was in the little in between the trees and the car path thing. We're gonna take a drop, last point of entry. Sh hitting three right here. Oh my God. That came out so fast. That shit came out chunky. So now we're hitting four. So now we have to get it close up and down for a bogey. That looks so good. Oh, that looks so good. Nice. Thank God I put that thing closed because look at this green. There's patches everywhere. But we put it close. And now we pretty much have a little, little tap in bogey. There we go. From what that hole was, from hitting it, having to drop, then chunking, I the bogey's actually a really good, feels like a birdie. Feels like a birdie. Hole 13, or yeah, hole 13. I think this is a, what was it, a par four, par five? I think it's a par four. Anyways, this is like a super pretty desert hole. You got the little palm trees, you got the backdrop back there from the mountains. You got some trees. And a big fat fairway that I need to hit. So I'm actually going to try to get after this one. I don't even care. It's just such a nice hole. I, I have to just go after it. Oh my God. I smacked that. And that might be perfect. Oh yeah. That felt so good. I got after that drive like crazy. Like I hit that thing hard. And here, cause everything goes way, like it doesn't go as far. I smacked it and I just shot, I shot it from where it was. And it was 274. Should have been like 290, maybe 300 on a good day. Here we go. Get up. Okay, that's actually, that's not that's not bad. I'll I'll take that. A little chip and birdie would be sick on this hole. It's one of my favorite holes right here so far. Come on, little chip and bird. Oh my god! I can't believe. I almost called that. <laughs> that would have been sick. Okay, we'll take the par. That was crazy. Oh my God, I wanted that so bad. Okay, here we go. We have hole 14. This is a long par three. Par three, 226 yard. Looks good. Oh, I think I hit it past it. Okay, went a little past the green. Not mad about it, not at all. Let's put it nice and close. I like, 
Did it stay? Okay, not too bad. If we can par this, this will be the first par on a part three, because these part threes have been kicking my ass. Oof, that was a good roll. I'm like dripping sweat though. We'll take the bogey. We'll take it from a 226 yard par three. Dude, hole 15, we have par four. This one, the line, like the aggressive line is to go over these trees to lay up. You kind of want to lay up over there. I'm going to go aggressive over those trees. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully get a good shot. Oh my God. Not the best drive at all from the kid here. It was horrible. Ran through the little car path, landed right here. We got a little break. I mean, it's not bad. Okay, here we go. Oh my God, that went in the hole and came out. That literally popped in the hole and came back out. I hope it's clear on video. Oh my god, that's insane. <laughs> oh my god, that was insane. That literally went in and just popped out. And now... Oh my god. That was tough. Hole 16, last stretch. Let's just finish strong, man. Can't believe that last hole. It's okay though. That's why golf is hard. I think that's okay. Yeah. Yeah. Right of the fairway, so we are right rough. And this thing is thick. That's why we couldn't find the ball for a second, but we found the ball. Let's just finish strong. Yeah, you probably couldn't see. I mean, it's so thick there. You guys saw what happened over there. The rough is rough. Now, best way to get through the rough and not have to take those shots, hit the fairway. But we can't do that right now. So... We are struggling for par up and down. That looks good. That looks really good. We're just going to raw dog. I've been lining my balls and the, the greens aren't breaking the way I'm reading them. So I'm just going to not even, you know, I'm not going to line them up and we're just going to shoot at it and shoot how we think it's going to break. This is for par. Maybe we should have been doing that the whole time. <laughs> oh my God. Let's finish strong. Let's finish strong. Can we get a birdie today? Who knows? Oh, look, there's a T already there. We're just going to go ahead and use that. Okay, we have 310 par four on this beautiful hole number 17. Two more to go. I'm gonna smack the last couple drives. Here we go. Yeah. I thought I took like the perfect line, but like I said, I've never played here. I should have looked at my thing. Anyways, now I gotta cut between these trees and get on the green. Let's see what we can do. <laughs> I didn't, but that worked out. It went not the shot we wanted, but the shot that that works out for us. So now here we go. Shot number three. Get it close. Another par would be great. Go in. Oh my god, I'm getting so close. Like I said, no more. We're just gonna raw dog go. Get up there, look at it, and putt. 
Okay. We'll take the bogey. Okay, hole 18, about to finish up the round. Super stoked with how everything everything went. The course is really nice for being in the middle of nowhere. 214 feet below sea level. It was one of the first golf course, one of the first desert golf courses with grass on it. It started as a par three for mine workers back in the day. And then obviously it became a beautiful 18 hole course. Price is great. Honestly, I would I would love to play this all the time. So for sure we'll be back eventually. I need to get my revenge because this was my first time out here. I, I don't think I played horrible. I don't think I played great at all either. A lot of a lot of messed up shots, but here we go. Last hole. Let's finish strong. A little should I just I'm gonna smack a big one for you guys. I had to go high right here. It wasn't a bad drive. Again, not the fairway, but it's okay. Here we go. Went left, but I don't know where left. Here we go. A little long. Just gotta get it out of here. Go, go, go. This is the opportunity for that chip in, huh? That we've all been waiting for today. Okay. Chip in opportunity to finally end this round. No. Thank you guys for watching. If you watched, if you clicked off, I don't blame you because the golf was not the best. Hey, that's a good bogey to end. All right, like, comment, subscribe, whatever the hell you guys want to do. Peace.